day, you just created a brand new intro on Blender, such as the one that you just saw. But you don't know how to export it. You click a whole bunch of random buttons, you click export, you click the file path, it doesn't work. Today, I'm going to show you how to export your Blender file or a .blend as a .mov or a .tiff or any other file type that you may need to use to put in the beginning of your video or to put potato. Alright, so this is what my intro looks like. And you probably made a template and edited the text. That's kind of what I did. So number one, you're going to want to go to the side of the screen over away from the actual uh, editing area. Over here you will find many things, but what you're going to need to look for is this little camera icon right here. When you're going to click that, and then you're going to scroll down to the output tab. Now, this may look a little bit intimidating to some of you people, but it's not too intimidating. Let me walk you through it. So right here, you have the file path. So you're going to want to click on this, and, and then it opens up with a screen that allows you to click here and change your file path. So say I want it in my YouTube saves folder. Well, you can do that. You can put this anywhere on your computer. This is simply just where it's going to save. After that, you're going to want to hit accept, and it brings you back here. The next thing over here, it are these little check boxes. These don't really do anything, just leave it as the default, which is this one checked, this one unchecked, this one unchecked, and this one checked. It should be whatever, you don't need to change them, It's not they're not really important. Down here, you're gonna wanna click RGB, it's most likely already on RGB. Again, just go with the stock settings. Over here, you're going to want to click this button, and it's gonna be default, I think, BMP, but these are all your different ones. So for so for video, you're gonna see it says movie right here. You're going to want to click um, FFMPEG video. Oopsie, whoa. Uh, if you're on an iMac or a Apple device, you can probably click, click QuickTime Player, but you don't really need to do that. So click this button right here. After that, you're gonna wanna go down here. Make sure that everything is normal. Uh, make sure that nothing's like, make sure that this isn't on um, like high quality or low quality, just leave it at default. And uh, yeah, on to the next step. All right, the next thing you're gonna wanna do is render it. Now this is the last step. So um, yeah, so all you're gonna wanna do is scroll up from that uh, input uh, or output thingy, and you're going to wanna click animation. When you click it, the screen will do this and start to play your animation. Now, I'm going to stop this because I don't want to have two copies of my intro, but pretty much this will take either from five minutes to an hour, depending on how long yours was. Mine took like 10 minutes because mine's kind of a long intro, um, but I think it's like I think it's like a minute for every like a second or something. It takes like a minute or something like that. I don't know. I forgot what the real rule is, but anyways, you're just going to want to leave it at this. Do not do anything with this. Just leave it alone, go walk away, eat a potato or something, and it will be in your folder. And now you can see that this is the folder where I saved mine, so you can just click on it. And um, actually, this is a great example. I stopped mine halfway and I had it overwrite my old one. So if you stop it halfway, it's gonna make it. It's just not gonna make the full intro, as you can see here. But normally, if you would let this go the whole way, but I clicked out of it stupidly, um, but if you would let this go the whole way, it will play your whole intro, and it works. Alright guys, so if you have enjoyed that tutorial, make sure to subscribe right here, or here, and check out two more videos right here, or here, or here, or here. Maybe everywhere. See you next time!